Okay, so this is gonna be my first vlog I'm gonna try and do for you guys. Um, so we sent in check-ins to Matt this morning and we had um, an over three pound weight drop. Um, so we were 268 this morning. So we're gonna do a high day with a date night tonight. Um, me and Matt haven't done those, I think for like a week or two. Um, but since we dropped pretty low, um, we decided to have a high day with some date night. Um, so for meal number one, we're gonna have mega fit ground beef, some jasmine rice, a little bit of banana, some almond butter, um, and then my morning pills from HD Muscle. And this is kind of what it looks like. Just all mixed, scrambled in there together with the morning pills. Okay, so we got meal number two here. We're gonna do um, mega fit chicken. We got sushi rice, a little bit of avocado, and then 100 grams of pineapple. And that's what we're working with here. A little ground cinnamon in there, some pink salt. Um, this will be the pre-workout meal for today. Um, and then we'll train about an hour later. We got chest, um, biceps, and a little side delt. Um, and that'll be it for the training session. So yeah, and then we'll do a little bit of cardio after, it's just what I do. Um, right now Matt has me doing uh, about a half hour after training. He lowered that a little bit, just you know, just keep moving since we did have a significant weight drop. Um, so yeah, pre-workout meal. We're gonna eat this and get going. So we just got to the gym. Just finished my new uh, pre-workout. <clears throat> like I said, I took the uh, apple grape and that was phenomenal. That was phenomenal. And I'm very excited for you guys to try this out. I think you guys are gonna absolutely love this flavor. Um, tomorrow I'll probably try, um, I've already tried them, but it's good to try them again. I've been having them for a while since I was in Canada and that was literally before prep. So just to get a refresher, you know, the apple grape is phenomenal. Um, but yeah, so we're here at the gym, just getting ready to walk in. Um, you know, this is one of those times where, you know, I like to just kind of sit and take a minute and analyze, you know, where prep started, where I'm at now, how it was going. And, you know, I can honestly say this has probably been one of the smoothest. It was hard. Don't get me wrong. It's been really, really hard, but smoothest as far as um, the body responding, you know, and, and it goes to show, um, you know, and I'm not, you know, making assumptions for myself for you guys to be like, oh, he's not going to do that. I, I think for my body, it just responds so much better with a longer break, you know, like, I didn't have so much of a longer break from the Arnold to now, so it sounds pretty, you know, kind of like a hip hypocritical, I guess. Um, but I know when I did the New York Pro, then the Arnold, then the Olympia, like mentally and body, I was, I was pretty shot at that point, you know? And I know with a longer rest, let the body chill. I mean, that's for anyone. But I know people that can go show to show to show and, you know, get better, get better, but, but get better, which I can to a degree. But, you know, this is where you try to figure out your body, what works best, what works this, what works that. And, you know, I do find for me being more fresh going into a prep is what it's what's, what's going to help me the most. Um, that being said, we are three and a half weeks out, um, you know, and my body is, you know, where I'm at three weeks out from conditioning wise, I think I was like, you know, um, where, I'm, where I'm at three weeks out. I feel like I was at like a week and a half out from the Olympia last year. So it's, it's really cool to see, um, you know, we, we did up the cardio a little bit. We did, um, you know, drop some food, which is fine. Um, we had a three pound weight drop, which, you know, allowed me to have a pretty hefty refeed today. So I'm pretty excited about that. You know, we'll see what the weight does in the morning. Um, you know, but I'm feeling good. You know, I'm feeling really confident. I know I made the improvements that I needed to make in order to be a champion. Um, and I, you know, my mindset wise, I know I'm where I need to be to become that champion. You know, Maria has been a great help. Matt's, you know, obviously the best coach for me. Um, my family's been super supportive. Everything has kind of just been really good this prep and I'm really happy about that. You know, mindset, everyone thinks, oh, you don't have the same mindset, blah, 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 blah. Fuck, fuck out of here. My mindset is more in tune than ever before. You know, I'm literally 268 this morning 
and I'm like w way more conditioned and bigger than what I was at this time out for the Olympic last year. So I don't know what the fuck y'all are talking about, but it's cool. I'm excited. I know you guys are excited and we're going to put on a hell of a show for you guys. And I am truly, truly confident and I don't give a fuck. I'll say it every goddamn year. I am truly confident. I'm going to win the Mr. Olympia this year. I truly am. I know everyone sees Derek, Hardy, Samson. These guys look phenomenal. I'm not even going to deny it. But y'all know what the mutant does. The mutant comes through and shocks the world every time he steps on that motherfucking stage. And this year, won't be any fucking different. So, time to go train. I'll see you guys afterwards. Alright guys, so... We just got done training, we are driving home. Yes, I am driving, recording. Please do not do this at home. This is very dangerous, very risky business. Um, but I'm gonna go home and, you know, eat. So I'm gonna get this part uh, out of the way. Um, overall, good workouts. Um, definitely increase the volume just a little bit. Um, you know, strength is still good, strength's still there, strength's still high. Um, uh, I didn't really try to push you know, PRs today, I just wanted to go in, good good squeezes, train pretty intense. Um, and it was overall a really good workout, you know? Uh, we had, like I said, some chest, a little bit of shoulders and biceps. Uh, that's what I do right now on the RP Strength app. I think I said, uh, I think I said in the HD video, I did um, separate the body parts just a little bit more, uh, being closer to the show. I just want to give attention where it's needed to the body parts, but especially with the energy being low. So, you know, instead of doing a push pull leg split, you know, Monday's legs, Tuesday we're doing chest biceps with one side lateral raise. Uh, Wednesday is back and traps. Um, Thursday we take off. Friday we do legs again, but this is more of quad. Uh, and then Saturday's shoulders and triceps with a little bit of chest, and then Sunday's off, and then we repeat. Um, I've been doing that for a couple weeks now, and I think it's been working, I like it. Um, so yeah, we're gonna keep doing that. But again, overall good workout. Um, definitely had a good pump, definitely think I think went a little flat at the end. Uh, probably pushed it a little too much, but that's okay. Sometimes, you know, going flat is not uh, necessarily a bad thing. Um, it's okay to go flat. You know, it's hard to get lean sometimes, you know. Uh, but it's okay. Um, like I said, we got a nice little high carb day, so we will be filling up. Um, and tomorrow, of course, we'll be sending pictures to Matt as well. So I'm excited, you know. And guys, for those that, you know, talk a lot of shit, you know, that I'm gonna die because, you know, I wear a fucking seep app. Um, listen, I love my seep app. That shit has been quite the game changer for me. Um, I love it dearly. It has, um, you know, I sleep a lot better. I wake up more energized, even being on low food. Um, and overall, it's just great. I love it. Um, it has definitely just, like I said, helped me tremendously. So, guys, honestly, if your sleep is shitty, sleep is not well, I advise you to get a sleep app. It has been tremendous. Um, yeah, you know, um, you know, before we close this out, before I show you my post-workout meal, you know, we are 3.5 weeks out. I'm feeling good. You know, I'm feeling great. I'm feeling very confident. Like I stated before, you know, training. I definitely feel like, you know, I can win this. I can win this. You know, and I know a lot of you guys believe in me too, you know, and, and, it, and it's just awesome. And I really feel like this is the year for me to conquer. This is the year for me to start the mutant error, era, whatever you want to call it, error, error. <laughs> era um sorry camera's flickering but we're in it to win it baby and i'm coming you know matt i listen to matt you know i know everyone's like oh you know these date nights ah trust me matt wouldn't give me date nights unless you know uh he he didn't think i needed them so there's a reason there's a there's a method behind the madness you know and i trust him 100 percent, and it has done nothing but i think better me mentally physically you know and it has helped me this prep and overall conditioning and everything else so fuck it um but yeah we're gonna close this one out we're coming in hot guys um a little foggy here but you guys can hear me um okay over and out see you post-workout meal
Alrighty, so we're getting ready to have meal number four here. Um, nothing crazy, we did a little switch up. We're gonna do 99% uh, ground turkey, lean ground turkey, um, and some sushi rice. That's really it for this meal. Um, next meal will be the date night meal with uh, Maria. We're gonna go to Barry's Steakhouse. Um, I'm not sure I'm gonna bring the camera. Um, I kinda like just, um, I kinda just like that for, la, 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 la. I kinda just like that to be me and her time. Um, to kind of just get away from social media, get away from the phones for a little bit, and just, just for me and her, connect, have fun, have a nice dinner. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. Um, so yeah, I'm going to take this meal down, chill out for a little bit, get a shower in, and then uh, we'll be getting ready to leave. So that's what we got going on so far. We are on our way to date night. Uh, Matt did not want me to change where we go for date night, so... It's another night of berries. Berries. So we'll show you what you get. So yeah, when I get there, we'll show you what I get, what I eat. Um, pretty plain, nothing too crazy. It's just a nice, you know, steak and potato, mashed potato. Um, Don't tell them. Well, yeah, we'll show, but it looks, no, I can tell them because it, it, it looks good, you know? Okay. Um, but I won't say what else I get. Don't give me shit. They're going to wanna... say that I tell you what to yeah, say. Yeah, you're going to tell me what to do. Don't tell me what to do. Yeah, don't come for me. They're <laughs> coming for me, for sure. Coming for love. Coming for love. Cause when I'm thinking of you, hey, all the... You should give a big thing. Nope. It's a load in there. First things first. Bread. bread is a must. They also have pretzel bread, but we're not getting that today. But even the regular bread, it's really good. This is the best one I've ever tried. For real. It just tastes... You just put the block on top. She just put the whole block on there. I ain't about that life. <laughs> I, I just like the bread. <laughs> Okay, so first part of the dinner after the bread. I got myself a nice Caesar salad. Here. We got some steak, onions, and mushrooms. Mashed potato. And over here, we got the truffle fries. She's just eating the steak. She didn't dig in yet. I already dug in. So. That's what it looks like for the main course. And we'll see you back for dessert. We got the carrot cake. Um, it's huge, very huge. They had another version that was a lot smaller, but they went back to the cake style version, which is fine. So it's very fucking good. My favorite of all time at Barry's. I'm gonna enjoy that. That is the end of the day in the life high food day. Um, it is the next day, but we woke up this morning. We had about, what was it, a two and a half, three pound weight gain from yesterday. Sent pictures over to Matt. Uh, Matt was very happy with what he saw. Um, but we went back to, or no, our regular diet today. Tomorrow's an off day, so definitely gonna do regular diet tomorrow. Um, I don't think he wants pictures tomorrow unless we have a dramatic drop somehow again. Um, but pics will be sent um, on Friday for sure. Um, we usually do Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays right now. Um, but if, you know, something, the weight dramatically drops or something goes on, normally we send pics um, in between if we uh, have to. Um, but yeah, so that was, you know, what we normally do on a high day um, with a date night special. Um, so yeah, that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed. And... This is my first vlog, and I kind of enjoyed it, so I'll probably do more of these. Hope you guys liked it too, and we'll see you for the next one.